So you finally got your hands on one of these, the deluxe audio straps from HTC Vive. But unfortunately, there's no instruction manual on how to remove this, the old crappy non-deluxe version. In this video, I'm gonna show you exactly how to replace this with this. So this is the easiest part of the whole thing, but first you gotta take the Velcro strap on the top of the headpiece and pull that through the hole on the front of the headset. But this next part is the part that HTC decided not to include in their instruction manual for some reason. These side joints can be removed by rotating them clockwise. One of them will snap in about one fourth of a turn and the other one will snap in about three fourths of a turn. So just keep going until you get a loud, somewhat scary click and they should come right off after that. Now that you have just the body of the Vive, you're gonna wanna locate this top front panel with the HTC logo on it. Now getting this open takes a little bit of force, but just push forward evenly with both thumbs and eventually it should pop open. The panel is housed in a slot and you wanna make sure that the lips are cleared before you pull upwards or you might damage your device. Now you should be looking at four cables. From right to left they go 3.5 millimeter jack, power cable, USB, and then HDMI. And you're gonna to wanna to disconnect all of these cords. It takes a little bit of jiggling around, but eventually they will come loose. With the wires out of the way, you can finally get to attaching your deluxe audio strap. You're going to attach the deluxe audio strap to the same anchors that you removed the old headset from. The deluxe strap is a little easier to get on because all it requires is just a little bit of pressure and the piece should snap into place. Now it's time to put the wires back into your Vive, but this time, rather than using the extension cable for the 3.5 millimeter jack, you're going to plug in the 3.5 millimeter jack that is coming from the left side of the deluxe audio strap. Before you do, be sure to feed that 3.5 millimeter wire back through the opening in the front panel, as you see me doing in the video. Then you're gonna take those three wires from earlier and feed them through that same opening. Keep in mind, you're not gonna feed these wires through the hole that looks like the Vive logo. You're gonna do it to the one that's on the panel directly. Once they're through, just plug them back into the correct spots and you're almost finished. The last and most difficult part of this entire thing is replacing that front panel. Due to the way that these wires are made and the shape of them, it's kind of difficult to push the panel far enough forward to make it get over those lips that I mentioned earlier. I found that the easiest way to do this is to actually push forward with one thumb first, make sure that it's over the lip, and then do it for the next thumb, rather than trying to do them both at the same time. That way, you don't risk breaking any cords, and you don't risk breaking the plastic on the panel. Once the front panel's back in place, all you have to do is loop the Velcro back through the strap, and you're almost good to go. And don't forget, one of the best improvements of the Deluxe Audio Strap is the cable management. So be sure to feed that three-in-one wire through the hook on the right side of the headset. And there you go. Now your Vive is equipped with the most comfortable accessory to date. Anyways guys, thanks for watching. Uh, if you thought this video was helpful, feel free to leave it a like. And if you're a virtual reality enthusiast, I recommend you check out some of the other videos on my channel. I do VR software reviews, hardware reviews, and more. All right, that's about it. I'll see you guys next time.